What's going on with Tectonic? It's your boy Crypto Million back on another one. This has been a highly requested video. A lot of people that's part of the community do follow their Tectonic news and actually hold Tectonic. So um, in this video, we're going to be taking a dive and what's been going on with Tectonic. We'll take a look at the chart, some of the things Tectonic has been working on. So if you like Tectonic, let me know in the comments if you are bearish or bullish on tectonic and speaking of comments because you can see here man for the last seven days tectonic has been on a downtrend in fact for the last month it's been on a downtrend and a lot of people are starting to get a little bit impatient here um in the comments of coin market cap now i'm not sure what's really going on with the tectonic app i'm hearing people saying um well actually let's, let's take a deep dive into what's going on um currently with the tectonic so it says uh seriously uh, this is from thom squires he says any takers seriously we are completely out of the loop here why can't we see our stake in vaulted tonic and i know a lot of people on the channel um are long-term holders they've been staking in vaulting their tonic for up to four years let me know in the chat if you can't see your tokens let's try to help out the people in the community man i think that's the most important thing instead of just spreading fud or lashing out i think the most important thing to do is to kind of help our uh neighborhood community members within the tectonic uh ecosystem so again a lot of people seem to be putting um negative comments here on the coin market cap and and this been happening for like the last month i've been seeing people saying millie the app's not working a lot of bugs on the app I haven't really been interacting with the app. Y'all know I, I interact with so much cryptocurrencies that I haven't really had a time to really um, take a deep dive into what's going on with Tectonic. I've been working to share all the Tectonic spaces with my boy Agent Double Zero. And I hopefully they, hopefully everybody in the um, spaces, hopefully they're, they're talking about some of the, the bugs and potential issues that the app is going through. But if you're having any problems with the app, let me know in the comments so we can kind of like figure this thing out uh, maybe reach out to the people behind tectonic and uh really make the community hold but you're seeing a lot of people man a lot of people here getting bearish on um tectonic here and i want to let you know guys that you know altcoins have been getting smashed even though you see bitcoin going up that doesn't necessarily mean altcoins will be going up now even though tectonic is down 16 percent on the month you know this is a favorable price if this is something that you're interested in sitting here at a 28 million dollar market cap the only concern i have have with tectonic and i'm gonna be completely honest with you guys here the only concern i have with tectonic is that a lot of d5 plays been going parabolic like DeFi plays like protocols lending ave pendo like a lot of those DeFi plays have been going um been doing well in the bear market but we just haven't seen that strength from tectonic now i'm not sure if it's the crypto.com marketing maybe the marketing's not there but i know one thing that's kind of holding back tectonic and the fact that it's not listed on listed here on any other exchange outside of vvs finance and crypto.com and i think once this project can get on a coinbase or just a few more exchanges it will it will it will be more a little bit more prosperous to tectonic holders now for the people that's here long term i know you guys y'all really don't care y'all been holding y'all tectonic in these vaults y'all earning insane interest there's a lot of people that's earning vino that's earning all this interest with these cryptocurrencies because of these tectonic uh isolated pools so there's been a lot of movement going on with tectonic you know despite a lot of the FUD, a lot of the negativity, you can't say Tectonic hasn't been building. Now, you know, to, to be fair, to, to play devil, devil's advocate here, you know, I would love to see some type of upgrade to the app, you know, and even website. You know, it's it comes a time when, you know, you got to switch things up. You got to bring something that's more a little bit um um what's it user friendly user interface friendly and i think that's been the issue here with tectonic and the app a lot of people complaining about the bugs in the app but you can't say that the project hasn't been building it's been constantly upgrading new tokens here for the liquidity pools i mean they updated a ada xrp cosmos and even vino and added fer to these liquidity pools where you'll start to see a lot of the people that's part of these um ecosystems and these projects migrate to tectonic lending and protocol but the question is are people using it what i want to do is i actually want to go check out the tvl just to make sure there hasn't been any um 
major movements in TVL. Again, I haven't checked a lot of stuff that's going on with Tectonic. I just want to make sure there hasn't been any uh, major um, movements here um, with the TVL. So, yeah, TVL um, slowly decreasing. It's been slowly decreasing um, over the last month. So, I wonder what they're working on. I wonder where where that liquidity is going. Like I say, um, Tectonic is a cross-chain money market for earning passive yield and assessing instant back loans. We know that, but the thing about it is, family, you want to see people actually utilizing the uh, the project, all right? Utilizing the utility, util utilizing the use case here with Tectonic. I think that's where the struggle is actually happening. So I don't want anybody to lose confidence in the Tectonic program. Like I said, this is not FUD. This is general talk. In fact, Feel free to be completely honest with your experience here with Tectonic. Now, taking a look at the charts here, um, we we did we did we did cross our cold red, so we crossed our cold red here, which was around um six zero one three six zero. I said if we if we cross cold red, there really isn't a level of support here, and then the next level of support would be in my little buy zone so this is my buy zone here for tectonic i actually haven't been touching tectonic because i kind of felt like it could hit this buy zone because we clearly have a death cross right here staring at us like looking us down down the pipe right there death cross right there staring at us you can see the huge move to the downside i've seen this exact same pattern with elon and we just kept you know going down going down you know it, there was no momentum even when the stock rsi as you can see right here um it's been showing a little bit of momentum here the project is still going down so you cannot sleep on these death crosses man a lot of people look at it like oh you know no these death crosses hit different all right so you're seeing a huge death cross here and you're seeing um the you're seeing what happens like you, you're seeing the you know <laughs> It's a lot of people. They look at the they look at charts and be like, "Oh, your technical analysis doesn't work on anything other than Bitcoin." But then you you pull up something like the death cross, and then you get this huge move to the downside, which Millie told y'all if y'all go watch the videos. And then it's like, "Oh, Tectonic is going down." Well, I, I told you we had a bearish cross here on the daily chart, so you should have been prepared to either um move some stuff around or add to your back. Now, if you are a long term holder and you're in this vault. You know, you just gotta bite the bullet and 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 understand that you know crypto is a long term game. Nothing's gonna happen overnight. You bite the bullet. You earn your interest. You earn your tectonic. You earn your ADA or whatever you're earning, and you kind of like stack and compound. I'll be looking at. I'll be taking a fly here at tectonic, and it's it's a maybe. I'm not gonna say it's a guarantee, but I'll be taking a fly here at tectonic around this level. But I want to hear from the community first and foremost. I want to hear from the community. Are there truly bugs going on with the app? Um, are you not able to see your staked or your vaulted tonic? I want to hear from the community first so I can get a better uh, sentiment. And then I'm going to go play around with it myself. I think that's what I need to do. I'm going to go play around with it myself and see if there's any bugs. If there's any bugs or anything that I personally see when I play around with it, then I'll be sure to bring it to the channel. But again, I haven't had enough time to really take a deep dive into tectonic link my life is crazy right now i got so much going on and i don't want to specifically just cover a you know a, a a bucket of cryptocurrencies i try to like extend my range cover a whole bunch of stuff that i've either held in the past or am currently holding because you know I don't give up on the community. So, again, we'll just have to see how this thing plays out, man. We'll just have to see how this thing plays out. Um, right now, the momentum is is pretty bearish. Pretty bearish. I'm not going to cap with y'all guys. It's pretty bearish. But we do have a lot of support here once we hit six uh, 6012 and down here to 708. So, if we do pick up the other zero, that's what I'll be looking for. You know, I'm not going to buy in on 601, 602. I'm looking at another zero here so somewhere around 709 i'll be looking to um add to the bags right there so um the tvl is is falling slowly so it's very slowly i want to know more about that that's 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 a concern that's a question mark but my biggest concern is the complaints that i'm seeing with the um the user interface and the tectonic app and a lot of people complaining about the tectonic app other than that you know a lot of cryptocurrencies are going down on a month you know a lot of cryptocurrencies are going down on a month I don't like that Tectonic didn't pump with the rest of the DeFi protocols because you would think like with DeFi 
coming back around and seeing so many different DeFi protocols pump, you would think that Tectonic would fit the bill. But the one thing, again, that's holding Tectonic back is the fact that it's not listed on any other exchanges. And that's 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 the, that's what it is. OK, it needs to be listed on more exchanges because we need more volume. You know, the volume will come up if it's listed on more more exchanges. I mean, I would love to see the volume well above a million dollars if we have a $28 million market cap. And that's just me keeping it real right now. We're at 33000 down 50%. So keep an eye on that. Y'all let me know what y'all think about Tectonic. Are you bearish? Are you bullish? It's your boy Crypto Millie. I'm out.